Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's Bolton Wanderers and they take on Huddersfield Town. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And number nine, John Danny Bovarsen. And here's the starting lineup for Bolton Wanderers. Well, it looks as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five, but I think the wing backs will have license to get forward at every opportunity. And also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two. And so the initial 11 for Huddersfield Town. Well, when you see it like that, their central midfield players look a little bit isolated. But I'm expecting the two fullbacks to push up to make it more of a 3 4 3. And I think we see a lot of positional rotation in this starting 11. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And so the match is underway. Into the advanced position. Morley. It's with Williams. This looks interesting. This looks promising. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, I thought he was brilliant last time out. Scored a couple of goals, but it was his general play as well that was excellent. Coming short to receive the ball, making runs in behind defenders. He was outstanding, and I'm sure we're going to see more of the same today. Well, attacking possibilities. He could pick out a teammate. Well, not hard to read that pass. Russell with it. Danny Ward. Russell. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And deciding to go short with this one. And pull back. And he did what he had to do defensively. Morley. Take it away. Oh, a nice looking pass. And he's apparently veered into an offside position, Stuart. Well, that's tight, really tight. But he was just too anxious to make his run. He was in, though. Harry Toffolo moving into the advanced position and stuffing out the danger. Chance to put them in front. But he must get rid of the ball. 
Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Might be able to get in behind the defence. Not showing good patience. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free-kick situation? Determined defending. It's with Williams. And a good looking pass. Now what can they do from here? Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. A sloppy pass. Thomas seemed to switch off for a moment and now a throw in here's Charles Charles chance to do damage the textbook interception Danny Ward so one minute of stoppage time that's what the officials have said it certainly wasn't a clean tackle and the referee has got to book him I think and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref's got that right it's a yellow card all day long John. and there it is the half-time whistle well probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag well I've been disappointed with him in that first half he just didn't have an impact on the game yes the service into him wasn't great but his movement needs to be a lot better let's hope he improves in the second half The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. O'Brien. Danny Ward. Russell with it. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Now, what can they do from here? Shot attempted. Well, tremendous block. Denied once more. Unable to keep the ball. How about the cross? Oh, the threat is there. Teammate and support. And it will be goalkeeper's ball.
Well, there it is. The visitors have completely dominated the game in the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Declan John. A creative look about this. He'll have a go here. And a body in the way. And giving it away. Thomas now. Promising sequence. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. with Williams Tom Lees plenty of options but they dealt with the threat posed well the fans believe there's hope here can the players respond now possession one A quarter of an hour remaining here. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And delivered towards the back post. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Well, this game will shortly be history. And the home side appear to be on the wrong end of the scoreline. Stuart, give us your take. Well, their attacking play has been too slow, it's lacked penetration, and at times it's looked devoid of ideas. But can that change in the final few minutes here? It only needs one moment of magic. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Cutting in, what can he do from this position? What well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Time for a change then. Number 16, to be replaced by number 32, Kyle Dempsey. Five minutes left. Young Daddy Birdvarsson. Well, they know they need to stop him. Oh, terrific piece of going. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, a bit short with the clearance. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.